here's the packaging. It's the 20 by 20 Mamba stack here, the 20 amp 4 in 1 ESC and F405 mini flight controller. This is the packaging that it came in. Here's all the rest of the packaging. Here's the ESC, which I believe is bad. Uh, I was very careful when I soldered it together. As you can see, there's no like visible signs of damage or anything. We'll check the resistance. No shorts. I plug it in, nothing happens. Should be hearing beeps from the SCs. You can see the motors are just fine. Okay, so I plug the flight controller in to the ESCs, which is also soldered up to my receiver and the video transmitter. You see the flight controller is working as everything else is powering up, but there's no tones from the motors or the ESC. So I want to show the ESC again. I was very careful when I soldered it. I covered it with tape. I went through with a loop and I looked at everything to make sure that there was no errors or solder problems or joints that shouldn't be there. Visually it looks fine, but as you can see, it's not working. Now we're going to plug it into Betaflight. You see this works fine. Move this around. That works fine. Everything appears to be fine. If I go to the motors tab, I'm gonna go ahead and plug this in. ESC should be booting up, but they're not. Now that that's plugged in, I'm gonna go to test the motors. And they're not spinning, nothing's happening. I'll show you the configuration. I have it on D shot 150. All right, I'm gonna plug it into BL Heli configurator here. Plug it in. Okay, all good there. I'll go ahead and hit connect. And then of course you have to plug the batteries in or the battery in to um, read the setup. So I plug the battery in. Again, no ESC tones. And I'll come down to read setup. It says reading setup finished right there. Nothing. Hit that again. It's not seeing anything from the ESC and you can see it's plugged in and the battery is plugged in too. I think just the ESC is faulty.